my people my people my people my people thank you very much for turning to my channel <clears throat> my name is marine Lung. thank you very much every day i come with um small tips which are very educative for now i try to do it daily just to but tips very education um educative tips last time my video i did about um the placenta the mystery of the placenta spiritually and i was i received a lot of um people they wanted to know more because most people is christian especially they are ignorant about the mystery of the placenta most people when they have babies <clears throat> they don't know um the mystery of the placenta um some people in some cultures uh, placentas are being eaten in some family they would eat their placenta when they have a baby they will um up cook the placenta and eat it in some family they will bury it in some family they will put it in water before we come there let me tell you people what's a placenta first um the definition of a placenta what's a placenta the placenta commonly referred to as after bed is a disc of tissue that connect a mother uterus to the umbilical cord the uterus and the umbilical cord <clears throat> and it's automatically responsible for delivering nutrient and oxygen to a fetus so the placenta is the one that will give nutrients and a food like food they talk about nutrient that's food and oxygen to the baby bed um after the baby is being born the placenta is being disconnected so it is disconnect from the, the mother and the baby um that placenta it has been proven that scientific scientists can keep that placenta for up to five hours and you know whenever there's life is something there's spirit in it whatever there is life there's spirit so um you see many people here they will take money and buy placenta sometimes if you have your baby like when i had my first child they came down can we buy your placenta um people would spend money just for that placenta so many people don't know um the the um spiritual background of a placenta and then you have um people that will for example is the, the placenta will be um buried you also have the demon in the land um for example when somebody wants to be killed as i said last time there was this general they wanted to kill him and all they have to do he was so strong a strong man of God, they struggle, struggle, they could not kill him. They keep invoking his name, so he won't, his face was not even coming. And then they had to locate where they bury his placenta. So when they succeed to locate where his placenta was, that's when they were able to invoke his spirit. And he now his face now was um, came out for them to spear him. But fortunately, they could not even spear him. But that was what even gave them the audacity for the witch doctor to be able to pull him to show his face. The placenta, the placenta, the mystery of the placenta. I can go the whole day talking about it. You have some people who um throw it in water. You have water goddess. Some people will bury it under the tree when they have a baby. That um, so your destiny depends on that tree. When the tree die, you die. When the tree is fruitful, you're fruitful. If that tree is not fruitful, you're not fruitful. So the demon of the um the of the forest also will take control over your placenta. So, and um, spiritually, I know that um, many people ask, uh, what should we do with the placenta at the end? At the end, when you have that placenta, oh, I'm going to come at the end of the um, my lesson. Um, so, the placenta is very, um, it's, a, it's a mystery. It's a mystery for that placenta. When you see the placenta, the placenta is a mystery. I will take, I will come from the book of John, uh, Job, sorry, Job 40, 16. Lo, now his strength is in his loin, and his force is in the navel of his belly. The loin is it, and the belly. So, there's a navel, there's a lot of that's when the placenta connect the umbilical cord, they connect the umbilical cord. So, um, the Bible talks about lo, his strength is in his loin, and his force is in the navel of his belly. So, that's where the strength is, the life is there. Your, um, your destiny can be can be can be rewind 360 degree wherever your placenta is being located that's why i was told about this story that um the the last time i talked about the man who was very educative he has a photo um 
a photogenic brain but for some reason because their parents they were afraid for him not to travel so they had to ask the witch doctor just to hunt on that placenta about this lady who was 50 years and she was a virgin and very dedicated so when she went the man of god asked her go ask your parents where you kept they kept your placenta she was told that her placenta was hung in the witch doctor's shrine so for all that year the placenta has been there hung on the witch doctor shrine so the bondage of a placenta you keep repeated circle one thing over and over you keep struggling when you are a lady sometimes men come to you over and over you're a very good girl you go to church you you know you do everything what the bible is saying but yet when men come for some reason they just run that could be a placenta bondage you've taken all type of exam or you keep losing one job after the other all the way you struggle that's the bondage of a placenta so the bondage of a placenta there's mystery about the placenta so um what are we advised to do what you advise to that when you have the baby after having that placenta make sure you dry it when it's dry then you burn it then you throw it away so there will not be any link with the um connected the baby with um any demon or any case or anything looking for that baby so sometimes it was being told that the placenta was probably um buried so pig came and dug the placenta and ate it and the destiny of that lady was being destroyed he has to took deliverance upon deliverance upon deliverance so we have to be careful handle your baby's placenta very well handle your, if your if your own has been eaten okay it was also told about this lady that they say go ask your grandmother where's your placenta she went and the grandmother said i ate your placenta so you leave in me and leave in you she said god forbid she needed deliverance because the grandmother was living in her so when people see her they see me the grandmother so everything she's doing the grandma in short she she is the grandmother so um all those things we have to know that there is very um this is something that most people don't know most christians especially don't know about the mystery of the placenta sometimes we suffer spiritually we don't know what we are suffering from um so i just came to tell us that we should not take we should be deep in life life is a whole mystery everything happened to you is a reason for that nothing just happened for nothing it has happened in you in the spirit before physically now you can see it so i uh, just want us to take life serious to take god serious sometimes we save god we are fire for him we work for him but we don't see result because sometimes we have not gone spiritually so if every problem have to have um have to be defeated spiritually before physical they keep saying that you've been living this sister have been living for god this brother what's happening she is still begging she's still struggling she don't even have nothing because sometimes it's a placenta bondage sometimes go to your local church ask your pastor sometimes you need another authority to help for deliverance sometimes you cannot do it by yourself maybe you need another person who is more um spiritually energized spiritually stronger than you to help you go through that deliverance through the word of god by the word of our testimony will overcome the kingdom of darkness. So let us just hold God serious. Let's not just ignore it and just say, wow, what's she talking about? Today my topic was about the bondage of a placenta. We really need it. Um we need God to deliver us. I will come next time to talk about the mystery of soul ties. Of ladies that you have slept with many, many men. That will be another topic, the soul ties to see what is happening. That's the soul ties, another um topic that is out of the lane and many people don't know about that that's a topic that you hardly see people like men of god talking about it you hardly see men of god talking about the placenta um all our preachers nowadays everybody's prosperity prosperity come you'll be blessed come you'll be blessed and salvation has been wiped out of it i just want to thank everyone if you're watching me you have not made the lord jesus christ as your lord and savior I said, Father God, thank you. I want the Holy Spirit come to my heart. I want to make you the Lord over my life. I thank you very much. In Jesus' name we pray. So you have made Jesus a principal over your life. So look for a Bible believing church. Go there physical. Don't see you watch online. No. Look for a church and go. If you can. So people are in an environment where they cannot. 
maybe um the environment is not safe there's war um strike and everything but if you're aware you can go to a bible believing church find a physical apostle policy iron sharpening iron we are here to help one another so i just want to thank everyone um share this video let's get viral my name is marie and don't before i leave i'm going to advertise i wrote books some of these books this one is nene to success syndrome this is a little bit about a real life story many many um i have what is life you can find them in amazon this is what is life you can find them in, in amazon um thank you very much my name is marie um keep sharing this video and please my people if you're watching me um don't take your don't take the the placenta lightly so um even you are abroad you have to still keep it like in a like do that in the desperate when they ask you um what you're about to deliver tell them you want your baby's placenta note you sign that after they deliver you want your baby placenta they will give you when they give you that placenta handle it well um put dry it save it allow it to dry you you burn it before you discard it please take care of your baby's placenta his or her future lying it don't give it for them to go and make makeup or to they don't want to make medicine no my people thank you very much uh my name is this is a deep topic we are going to continue my name is marino thank you very much see you in my next video i come daily for now with Little, little tips.